Hello, everybody. Happy Sunday. Can you still hear the music, too? Or is that too quiet now? Yeah, you can hear it. Okay. Hello, Jay. Wow, that thing's legendary. I don't know why it does that. It's tight in there. All right. Hello, Jay. Hello, Maxwell. Hi, Josh. Ghostly Raider, thank you so much. I don't have my mug today. It's in the wash. <laughs> but thank you so much for getting a membership. And congrats to Cannon Boy. Hello, Sean from Canada. Very cool. Hello from your southern neighbors in New York. It's crazy. I'm in the chat every time. And I still have yet to get a membership. It's so bizarre. Guess you just gotta buy one. I'm a $20 patron for five years now. Do that math. Hello, Red Hood. Hello, Subject Delta. Happy Sunday, Justice. <laughs> You're an ugh. He's here. I'm out. He's not going to be here the whole time. He's just here for the just chatting. Hey, Riley. How are you? Hi, Lewis. So, obviously, um, don't normally stream on Sundays, but I was feeling Stardew. So, I said, what if I stream Stardew? And Mr.'s like, Mr. Light's like, what if you did? And I was like, nah, I'm not going to stream it. Let's just relax tonight. And he's like, but what if you stream Stardew? <laughs> I was like, okay, fine, right, let's stream Stardew. <laughs> it's like, you could also just talk. Yeah, I could just do and, just chatting. But and chat. Basically, that's what Stardew kind of is. Anyways. Yeah. But it's going to be really relaxed. We don't really have a game plan. I'm just going to start a new game and we're going to hang out. and We're going to fight the scaries. Check out our new emotes that we got for those of you who have access to those. Look at that, 10,000 kbps. And if you have the Sunday scaries, it's the perfect way to get rid of them. Because it's the coziest atmosphere you can have. We can light a candle and make it a little cozier. Ghostly wants to know if your account is a branded account. Shouldn't be. What does that mean? You want to check me for a brand? No. Like you... <laughs> it's like a business account. You can't get it. I got the big old LW on my chest somewhere. Glee! You're back. How are you? I knew, <laughs> I knew Reese was going to get the notification and be like, oh, look at this guy. <laughs> TZ, Tegan is Mrs. No Days Off. Yeah, I just, you know, this didn't, Stardew doesn't really feel the same. I might be regretting that tomorrow, but. Probably not. Will you be playing Manor Lords on Friday? I will not. I really don't know anything about that. I'll have to look into it. That doesn't mean I won't play Manor Lords at some point, but I probably won't be playing it on Friday. Reese, I am so sorry about that. I went live and it wasn't on YouTube and I was like, um... Where's my stream? Thanks and then I was that. like, I, I just got an email from Twitch that said, your stream summary, zero viewers. <laughs> I was like, oh great. shit, I think I went live on your Twitch. <laughs> my bad, Reese. That'll be great for the algorithm. Hey, Dom Dom. Yeah, we are streaming today. Well, I'm streaming today. He's he's going to be over there playing his games, but I don't know if this will be an every Sunday thing. It might be. Sunday Stardew has a nice ring to it, but we'll see. Hi, Lemons. If it's a brand account, supposedly you can't get gifted subs. Shite. Hi, Anthony. How are you today? Jam to the music for 70 seconds. It was the shortest stream known to man. Hey, at least it wasn't like when I went live on YouTube and my camera was up and everybody was in the background. That was funny. Hello, Ja. From Indiana. Very cool. Welcome, welcome. Happy Sunday. Hello, Jaron. What's up? Nothing. Just getting ready to stream. How was your weekend? Mel, Stardew! Been obsessed with this game recently, or lately. Wow, just changing your words. With this game lately as shown by my avatar. I love it. I did the same thing. Um, yeah, I have been too. Uh, so we're going to start a new save so that I can continue, continue to play my own save <laughs> off stream. But I've been having a lot of fun with it. It's one of those games where I become it becomes my entire personality and then I don't touch it for like a year. And then it becomes my whole personality again. It's just one of my comfort games. Glad you're streaming today. It was a shitty day, to be honest. Board is always glad. Ah, oh, heck yeah. Glad you can be here, and hopefully your evening gets a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Hi, Clarissa. Clarissa. It's vigorous waving. I'm vigorous. Vigorous. Hello, Spillin. Started just hit Game Pass. Should I download it? Yes. Um, I personally prefer it on PC compared to consoles, but it is good on consoles. Like, I played it for the first time on console, and it didn't feel like it wasn't meant for console. But as soon as I played it on the computer, I don't want to go back to console, if that makes sense. So if you've never played it before and you play it on console for the first time, you'll be fine. Hi, Nick. Maddie. 
Let me just say hi and go continue watching Bloodborne. Hi and bye. Okay, have fun with Bloodborne. <laughs> it's a doozy of a video, three hours long. Mm -hmm. Tons of hours in Stardew. I own it on PC, Xbox, and Switch. Um, I, I have it on every system. <laughs> I think the first time I got it was PlayStation. Then I got it on Xbox after that. Then I got it on Steam on my Mac. I usually play, my Mac is my laptop, so usually I play it there. Um, and I think I have it on Switch too, but I'm not sure now. Actually, I don't have it on Switch. I was going to say, I haven't seen that. You know what? I downloaded it on Switch for a trip. No, and then I had to be connected to the, the internet the and Steam I couldn't. Deck you had it on. Maybe. I don't know. Doesn't matter. No. I own it everywhere. Yeah. Uh, Lady Killer Justice. Hello. How are you? Happy. Well, it's Sunday for us. So happy Sunday. If it's Sunday for you as well. Yep. Anthony says hi to you. Hello, Anthony. All I was going to do was play Stardew tonight, but I watch you play instead. You can nice. play while watch me play. It's definitely one of those. Lemons, you know what we should do sometime is play co-op. That'd be fun. Will you maybe play some multiplayer games anytime soon so all of us can join in and play together and have fun? Um, wow. Vito, that's not really something that I do. Uh, simply because a lot of times I have... Like, I don't want people to know my username and stuff because I can't accept any of you as friends because a lot of times I'm playing things that are, um, like, I had NDA signed about because I get early access. So it just makes it tricky if I have people that I'm friends with that can see what I'm playing. Uh, so I get very nervous about breaking NDAs and stuff. So unfortunately, probably not. But that doesn't mean no. <laughs> it just means probably not. Uh, but we'll see. Nick, we are two and a half episodes into Fallout, and we are loving it, but we just really haven't had time to watch it, because every time we're free, we stream instead. <laughs> Tex! How are ya? Sons and I have multiplayer save on Xbox with 120 hours on it. We're going to start a new save when the update comes to consoles. Nice! That's awesome, Reese. Is it fun playing co-op? I haven't played co-op yet. Co-op what? This. Oh, I didn't even know this was co-op. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should get it on Switch. It's easy to play while I'm trapped. Yeah, that'd be fun. Quinn, happy Sunday. Went to Walmart yesterday, bought a new Dr. Pepper called Creamy Coconut. That sounds gross. How was it? <laughs> wow. They just keep coming out with flavors. Love to watch us play A Way Out. Is that the one where you're in jail? It's like the co-op game, yeah. All right, Lemons, we'll figure it out. We'll figure out the best way to do it. Playing Red Dead 2 while I listen, not in public. Because I'm on <laughs> Well, I hope you have fun with Red Dead 2. Co-op is so much fun. You can divide chores and tasks and get so much done. Nice. Awesome. Cool. Well, like I said, we're going to start a new farm. Um, I'll let you guys, like, give input and stuff on, like, my farm name and what pet we choose and all that stuff. Got to change my username because I only just realized how to <laughs> You don't have to change your username as long as you don't mind me butchering the pronunciation. I was just going to call you the Ja. <laughs> I am doing well, Tex. Thank you so much. It's nice to see you here. I like how I just said I didn't know there was co-op. It says co-op right on the screen. It does. <laughs> but that's okay. You weren't lucky. Clear writing. Hello, Weston. Stardew. You've been reborn and blessed. Wow. <laughs> we would love it, really. I don't really love coconut flavor. I love coconut scent. Yeah, she's a big coconut center. That's true. All my lotion. Coconut. If you want to know or, what it smells like. Or vanilla. Coconut or vanilla. Always. Yeah. Mel, I have, um, not a lot, but I have played a bit. I think I just finished year one, um, on my personal save file mm. with the new update. I haven't really sleepy. done a ton of new update stuff though. I've, obviously I've gotten some of the new seeds and stuff, but I haven't really done like any of the new fishing things or stuff like that. So you guys are going to have to guide me. I can't with coconut flavor. It tastes like air freshener. Yeah. It just, I always expect it to be more flavorful than it is. And then it, it's like, I don't know. <laughs> never does it for me. I love the smell, though. Vito. Very good looking headphones. Thank you. These are, um... Garbage. No. Razor. <laughs> These are Razor. The Razor crack in, I think. Lives on Cherry Coke and News Rep. New Rep. Nice. Very nice. Update on the Reaction Channel. Up 2,000 subs. Alright, Tom. No worries. Take your time. Sounds good. Have fun. We'll see you when you're done. Set it up some. Game suggestion for Scary Friday. It's called Silent Breath. 
I'll have to look into that. I saw one that was really interesting. It had great reviews, but you had to actually be silent and you couldn't like make a noise or the character would hear you. And I was like, it's well, I can't do no, that because I have to talk on Steam. It's one of those on four, stream. It's one of those 4D games where you just you, through the meta quest, through this the smelling thing it has, somebody just hasn't flossed in eight years, and then the scent comes through and they talk to you. Silent breath. Oh. Silent but deadly breath. Got it. That's what it is. Hey, uh, Jonathan. How are you? Hey, uh. Hey, yeah. Hey, Outcast yeah. over here. There it is. <laughs> Zeno has entered the chat. Welcome, Zeno. All right, you guys ready to do this? Are you ready? Boom, back for the name reveal. Jack, that's much easier to know how to pronounce. Although I did like the ja. <laughs> you will always be the ja now. All right, let's see. I have to actually turn this off because that was Spotify playing that. Star do or star don't. That is the question. Oh, your screen went away. So and there it is again. If this is um something we would oh. Oh. Is that too loud? Oh. oh. Why does that keep happening? And there she goes. That'll get all your belly gurgles on there. Yeah, perfect. So that's exactly what we need. Nice, Jonathan. It's just a lightweight day for you. All three hours of it? All oh, three hours. That's what happens when you record it in two chunks. You lose track of time. Like, what stops that from spinning? It's a touch lag, but barely. Says Quint. Not me. I didn't say it. Don't a be touch loud. I, I couldn't hear you because it was loud in my headphones. Okay, let's see. I like how you messed with the desktop audio and then the screen went away. <laughs> How's that better? How's that better? Yeah, okay. How's that? Better? <laughs> that was the um, assumptive close. How's that better? Okay. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Ah, new emotes! First try! Let's check out the, the new emotes. I was going to say, lovely, the streamers in this chat. Let's <laughs> go. These are all our new emotes. So we have. The first one is the cryy one, where I'm sobbing. Just every reaction video. Every reaction video. Then we have the love, then we have the gasp. Dr. Pepper. And the cowgirl. And phrasing. And first try. Rome didn't got built in one day. Rome didn't got built in one day. They're so cute, I love them. So um, that is eight bites, if you are interested she has a different art account but i can't remember what that is called off the top of my head but if you go to eight bites on um twitter you'll see her art there too so check her out because she's freaking fantabulous yeah you might see her doing other stuff now yeah they are a bit small i might have just uploaded the wrong file size though to be fair so i'll check that yeah but they're on par with every other email size that's true that's true. Thank you. All right. Hello, Jesse. My, on Twitch, on my top sub, um, if you are a six month or more sub, you get the one where her back's against the wall looking blushed. Phrasing. <laughs> you say one wrong thing and it never gets slipped down. And then you make an emote. So you make it worse for yourself. <laughs> All right, sounds good. Back to my GTA 5 playthrough. Yeah, polar opposite, huh? <laughs> the internet is forever. <laughs> have I played Stardew before? Don, I have played Stardew before. Um, so I, my longest play time, I did complete the community center, but I didn't do anything with the, whatever the island is. Like I got there, I made the boat and I went there and then I was confused and overwhelmed. I didn't do anything with it. And then I got to the desert as well, but I never did anything with like the caverns over there because I was getting my ass whooped. Zeno, welcome to Super Lightweight. Why does that keep happening with my stream? Where are you going? Why? Look at, okay, listen. My microphone doesn't want to stay up. My stream keeps disappearing. Jesse, have a good lurk. Thank you for being here. 
Have a good lurk. Have a good lurk. Well, they said they were lurking. Happy lurking to you. Happy lurking Sunday. Great wording. <laughs> Ray, thank you so much. I'm glad you're enjoying them. All right. I'm going to make my character how I want her to look, which is how she always looks. Because, you know, I'm unoriginal. But I like the look. Hello, Jeffrey. Never progressed beyond the community center either. Yeah, so maybe this will be our first for all of us. But I'm definitely going to need you guys to guide me. Um, I have to, like, find the hairstyle that I like. I like these little, the little braids. But I'm going to have you guys name the farm for me. My, my save file that I'm playing through right now, off stream, is um, Honeydew Farm. I thought that was so cute. Where's the hair that I just found earlier that I liked? There's so many hair options. Is it this one? Oh yeah, it's this one, okay. And... Gotta go with the blue eyes and the super white blonde hair. You know, because I wish I was Siri. <laughs> Just want to let you know that your mom is in the... Oh, Jeffrey, I'm so sorry. I hope she recovers soon. Can't wait till the update comes to consoles. Seems like a lot of people are really excited about that. Laszlo's Applewood Farm. I don't know if all that will fit. I could just do Applewood, though. That's what I said. That was the farm of my Animal Crossing. Or that was the Animal Crossing Island. Applewood. That's funny, because that was pre-Laszlo Applewood. I know. You yeah. were like a psychic moment. Yeah, it's a cute name, too. Applewood. It's Applewood nice. Farm is cute. And the only reason I picked that is because I got apples as my native fruit on the trees or mm -hmm. whatever. I do miss, I do miss that, too. All right, obviously my favorite thing has to be Dr. Pepper. I mean, duh. On our co-op game, I let my kids create the character for me because they <laughs> Ray, still have to share a picture with us sometime. <laughs> All right, I like looking like I'm in overalls, um, but I want, if there's like a white, different color undershirt under the overalls. So many options. I almost wish that there was like a kind of like Baldur's Gate has where you could have them all up so you can kind of see what you're looking for. You know what I mean? Maybe I'll do the blue undershirt. Damn. Do they add more options with the update? Or have there. Oh my god, a little mouse. That's so cute. Oh, that's kind of cute. This is what I want. I wish they had a portrait creator in the game. Oh, that would be a good idea too. Too bad I can't farm Dr. Pepper, I know, but I can get um, Joja Cola or whatever. All right, so my name is just gonna be probably late cause you know, I'm boring. What should my name be? Let's come up with something fun. This could be Laszlo. <laughs> Laszloina. Jeffrey, this is Stardew Valley. There was a, a update that came out not too long ago. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Lazla, there you go. That's less of a mouthful than Lazloina. <laughs> Am I romancing someone? Heck yeah, I'm gonna romance. I don't know who. On my my personal save file, I think I'm gonna do I think I'm gonna do um Sebastian, because I've never romanced Sebastian. But I think for you guys, I'm thinking either. Abigail, Leah, or maybe um, Haley, because I've never romanced her. Actually, I've never romanced any of those, so. They did another, another update two days ago? Damn. Quave, how are you? Or should I say, Quave. <laughs> Hello. But I'll let you guys choose Laszlo Wiener with a W. Okay, hold on. Let's do a little, let's do a little vote here. Lordy, where'd my mouse go? Let's do a little poll. 
Sorry it goes black when I changed my screens. I don't know why that. My name. Do we want Lazla? Or Lazloina? And if you haven't seen my, um, if you're not in on the joke, <laughs> if you haven't seen my, shit, what playthrough was that? Nope. That was Cargo Bob. L.A. Noir. L.A. Noir. If you haven't seen my L.A. Noir playthrough, check that out because I tried to read cursive and I read it as Laszlo Applewood. And it was not even remotely Laszlo Applewood. Laszla? Okay. You're here for the fishing streams? Hell yeah. Gui, this was not part of the weekly schedule, so you didn't miss anything. This was a spur of the moment. What if I decided to do this? Lazla, okay, Lazla it is. This music is just so satisfying. All right, we'll go Lazla because it's less of a mouthful. Uh, I am gonna do one of the the new um, meadow farm or whatever, meadow lands farm. Hold on, give it a second. There it goes. <laughs> Um, all right, let's do this thing. So we have, my name is Lazla on Applewood Farm. My favorite thing is Dr. Pepper. Here's my little character. And, oh, we have to choose our pet. I have to go with the black, ooh. Okay, so I'm, uh, mm. I currently have a black cat. Should I do the white cat? The beach farm is a good one. I haven't played the beach farm yet. If I love fishing. I don't particularly love fishing. I do fish. I don't hate the fishing. I just also don't love it. I saved your Sunday. Aw. Is, um, Mel, is the the beach farm new with the update as well? Honestly, prior to this, I'd, I've only done the standard farm. I haven't done any of the other ones. Beach farm's not new? Okay. But Mel, you have inspired me. Next time I do a a personal playthrough, I'll do the beach farm and give it a try. All right, let's do this. Oh, Meadowlands and Beach from the big update. The other were previous update about three years ago. All right, let's do another vote then. You guys are gonna choose everything for me. So for those who aren't familiar, Meadowlands is good for farm animals. So if you like to have a lot of animals on your farm, Meadowlands is good. Or the beach looks like it's good for foraging and fishing. Lemons, I will teach you my ways. Are there any plans to play Andromeda? Ooh, 50-50. Ooh! Oh, the, the best Mass Effect game? <laughs> Regarded by all the Mass Effect fans as the best entry of that series. All right, Beach Farm, I see you. Lemons, you'll teach me how to catch a fish in real life and I will teach you how to catch a video game fish. <laughs> How's that sound? Maxwell, I am gonna play it by ear. I will see what people want to see and it probably won't be right away, to be honest, because there's just so much I have to play. All right, Beach it is. Look at these close votes. Quave, he is not. He's currently playing Cuphead over on the TV over yonder so he's here but he's not all right you guys are gonna have to coach me because this is gonna be way outside my wheelhouse you wouldn't blame me if i didn't play it <laughs> there's grandpa and for my very special granddaughter i need ken to do my special effect voices i want you to have this sealed envelope Look at his little Junimo up there. I never noticed that before. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Now, listen close. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. <laughs> he is Santa. 
and your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. Damn, Grandpa! When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Hey, Mo! Surprise! Now, let Grandpa rest. And by rest, we mean die! <laughs> Joja, join us. Thrive. Hello, Boltine. Look at this cowboy licking his lips like a creepo. What the hell are you doing, sir? Why are you doing that? Life's better with Joja. Dear Lazla, my Roomba is in my bathroom headbutting the tub. <laughs> Jonathan, it's not supposed to do that. Mo, well, I'm doing very well. How are you? Happy Sunday. If you're reading this, you must be in a dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I'd lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Applewood Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my dear. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? We will be referencing our holy bible of this game. The Stardew Valley guidebook. Hello, Ike Pike from Sweden. Very cool. How are ya? So is it uh, Monday for you now? Text to my son to tell him you're playing Stardew and Autocraft kept changing your name. You are now Taryn and T-Fan. <laughs> nice. My phone autocracks my name to Taryn as well, which is a little disappointing considering it's my freaking phone. Hello, you must be Lazla. Did you used to hear any scary stories when I was a kid? Um, yes. I think. Do you have one, one in particular you're wondering about? Hello, Light Sidious. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. Here's, he's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Yes, Mo, that is correct. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me. Mondays and Wednesdays for Red Dead Platinum Streams. Fridays for Freaky Fry- Whoa! Wait, <laughs> for some reason I pictured my farm actually on the beach, like of the map. <laughs> like I am doing wonderful, wonderfully, wonderfully. I'm having a great night. <laughs> Thank you for asking. Hello, Jacob. Your first time here. Welcome. I hope you enjoy the stream. Thank you for hanging out with us on this fine Sunday evening. I think it's trying to commit suicide. I have to clean its brushes at least twice a week. Due to oh my gosh, yeah, our Roomba broke because my hair destroyed it. Oh hell yeah, Mo. Definitely paid extra for these beach reviews. The weeds have grown onto the trees. Yeah, we have um the moss. This is Applewood Farm. <laughs> What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. <laughs> and here we are, your new home. Hey, Lewis. Ah, the new farmer. <laughs> If this is why I don't act. <laughs> well, <laughs> I can't even do it anymore. <clears throat> Welcome, I'm Mary Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know everyone's been asking about you. <laughs> it's 
Starlight's looking over at me like, what the fuck is wrong with you? It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. My day is going great, Jacob. I'm having a wonderful time. How about you? As Uncle said, what are we going to farm here? <laughs> Rocks, exactly. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Hey, Jim. We should dress up as Lewis and Marnie for Halloween. I love that idea. <laughs> rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt, though. Rude! <laughs> Don't listen to her, Lazla. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. <laughs> anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. Thanks, Jim! <laughs> Thanks, Gwen. I'm just pure talent. <laughs> the trick will be to remember whose voices were what. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Jonathan, it's on Steam Deck. Well, good luck. Lewis here is the same color as- <laughs> yeah, seriously. Watch out for Laura Bailey, there's a new queen of voice. <laughs> Ooh! Wait, my house is so cute! Mel, this was a great idea, thank you. Push me outside my comfort zone. This is why I need you guys. You received 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Mayor Lewis. Alright. It's Monday, but I always like to check the TV. This one's for all you greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forage to earn some cash while waiting for your first harvest. And then, not that it matters for today, but I like to see what the uh, spirits are doing. They're somewhat annoyed today. This is like a, such a cute little beach Florida house. Brett, I'm so glad you love this game. I hope you enjoy hanging out in the stream with us today. Hi, Cody. Okay, so we have to clean some space and then I want to go buy some more turnips. You guys have to remind me, I always freaking forget, I always forget to, um, to use fertilizer. And I need, I need the freaking gold star crops for the community center. And I always forget to get my gold star crops. So it's your job to remind me. Um, actually, how do we want to do this? I have a setup for when I do go to the mines and stuff, but obviously we're not there yet, so. Now, I can plant in the, um, sand, correct? Would I ever play Tony Hawk Skateboard? Probably not on stream, but maybe as, like, a... <laughs> a one-off stream. You know, maybe if we can uh, do some celebrations for getting close to like 100,000, that could be one of the things that we... Yeah, we got to do some, yeah, do some uh, somethings to get... We're, we're so close to 90 and so far. Got to clean all this shit up. So the way I like to play, and you guys can coach me, please. I will not be offended. Because I have fun with this game, but I'm not like a min-maxer with this game, if you will. I know! Acting like I know shit. Um, the way I typically like to do it is get as many parsnips as I possibly can at first, and then sell them all so I can get some good money. Um, so day one, I pretty much try to clear up the land and plant some stuff. Thanks, Quinn. Hope to see you again soon. Have fun at rehearsal. And then day two, I'll go around and start actually focusing on talking to people. You can plant in sand, but sprinklers won't work here. What? No! 
Oh, rip to my sprinklers. Well, okay. So I don't have to worry about, that's actually nice because I don't have to worry about setting up my farm in such a way that my sprinklers will. I have 15 right now, so we want to do like this. So is there a way to, I have to like water them by hand every time? There's a patch of land to the south. Like down here. Someday I'd love to have you as a guest on your, your podcast. Do you have a podcast? All right. Well, maybe one thing what we need to do early on. Oh, my God. I already have no energy. <laughs> Is explore the layout of the new farm because I'll also need to find where Grandpa's shrine is and where the cave is for when we can eventually get our mushrooms. I also already need to make one of these. You also need to make sure you hold me accountable for my chest management, okay? So where would be a good spot to house all these? This is so weird. I'm not used to this. Um... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Where do I want to put all these? I kind of want them by my house. I guess I'll just put them right here. All right. Store you for now. And might as well... Actually, shoot. We'll keep that because I want to get some more. We'll go this way. Okay. I'll put you back. Have I ever played any army games? I have not. Yes, Lemons, please manage my chest. You ignored the phrasing? This is the perfect time to use the emote! Been nothing to do all day. I don't understand. There's like a new obsession with Harvey. I don't get it. I don't get it. He's just like a bump on the log. Okay, fair Jim. Fair Jim. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. I hope you'll find your work equally rewarding in time. All right, Harvey. <laughs> You're on good behavior today? Okay. I'm also really bad about birthdays. So we'll have to figure out something for Lewis because his birthday is... It's the glasses. <laughs> Pretty early. I need a voice for Leah. I feel like my voice is going to be Robin's voice. <laughs> I'm already out of voices. <laughs> Hello, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Caroline. Hello, you must be Lazla, the new farmer. My husband runs a general store here. Have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with purple hair. We're 30 minutes in and I've learned I've been playing this terribly wrong. Lemons, there is no wrong way to play this. You can be, play it any way you want. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving on to the, that, that old farm. <laughs> it's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Feel free to keep exploring those fields. Zeno! What the heck? Thank you so much! Just became a member to your channel, Lightweight Gaming, enjoying this so far. Heck yeah, Zeno! I appreciate you. Close my eyes for a second. I thought I was watching like breaking news. <laughs> breaking news of starting a farm. 
Hey, it's Miss Lazla. Damn. The new farmer, I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is a place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. A little agricultural could go, blah, 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 blah. a little agriculture <laughs> could really inject new life into the local economy. All right, so let's see here real quick. Oh shit, we haven't been introduced to the community center yet. Um, so obviously we need a lot of parsnips, but I just wanna get one of everything that I need for the community center so I don't forget it. So I'm gonna open up my handy dandy trusty notebook here. And find the community center. I need to go through this and I need to put sticky notes so I know where everything is. Bum, 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 bum. I sang the wrong song. It's fine. Friendship, kids, day cycle. Where are you, community center? Farm upgrades, crop grading. Farm buildings. <laughs> I think we need a cauliflower, a potato, a parsnip. I know we need the the gold star parsnips. Yeah, fuck it. I don't know. I'll figure that out later. All right, so I'm going to buy one cauliflower seed because I know I need that. I know I need one potato seed. And I don't need anything else, but let's at least get a couple of... Well, let's get a buttload of parsnips first. And I want to make sure that I get, um, <gasps> he doesn't have fertilizer yet. Wait, for real? See, you can tell I never use it. I always forget the fertilizer. <laughs> okay, well. We could only afford 18. That's all right. Start small. Greatness from small beginnings. The beans are nice because they do keep growing. Um, I found parsnips. I've already greeted seven people. I found parsnips, um, at least at first, seem to make me the most money because they're a four day grow cycle and they're the cheapest, so. Hi Sam, how are you? Welcome to Applewood Farm. Uh-oh, I don't think we're going to be able to plant all these today. Oh, this is going to be one, two, three, four, five. Oh, perfect. I realized just in... No! Eat the dandelion. Oof. That's still not going to help. Oh, God. Don't do that. When I'm just um, walking through town, I always have to keep my scythe on because I accidentally use my tools all the time. So I have to make sure that I'm using something that's not going <laughs> to... Not going to use energy. Mel, we picked the beach. I put it up for a vote and the people spoke. They liked your idea. But I am like such a noob at the beach. I'm going to need some guidance. Let me tell you. Shit. I need food. I've got no food and I only have 10, 10 gold. Well, all right. I guess we're going to go talk to people. Who eats a dandelion? Lazla does. Someone named Lazla. That's who. Reese, no, I only had a dandelion. So I'm giving up for tonight. We'll, <laughs> we'll water the rest tomorrow. We're just going to go talk to people instead. Maybe we can find some other things to eat while we're out searching. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. <laughs> Don't make that face at me. That voice is perfect. Penny. Oh, hello. I'm Penny. <laughs> Maru. Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. I'm not going to always read all their dialogue, but since it's the first time, I'll read their dialogue. 
You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dyna dynamic. It's exciting. Treating this like a science experiment, Mario. I see you. I see you. Oh, I should go, um... One of the beaches do a full 360 of the farm map. Stuff washes up on the shore all the time. Heck yeah, cool. Ugh, I hate him. I hate Alex. I'm putting it on record now. He's the worst. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think I, <laughs> I think we're going to get along great. I'm Alex. We're not, Alex, actually. I'll see you around. What a douche. Pam. Hey, kid. Name's Pam. <laughs> don't be a jerk and we'll get along fine. All right, well, don't, don't go talking to Alex. Oh, Sam was my first romance. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. <laughs> Sorry, Reese. Not you. Promise. This Alex is a douche canoe. <laughs> it's irritating having to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. <laughs> all right, George. I am George. Like, I will, but I don't want to look when people are around because I don't want them to be grossed out. I don't need to give them the ick. I just met them. Did you say pan? No, I said Pam. M. I didn't enunciate very well. I will check these ones because there's no one around. Okay. See, this is why I always keep my scythe on. Because I just watered the house. <laughs> Haley. Oh, you're that new farmer girl or whatever, aren't you? Oh, she needs to be a valley girl voice. Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. See, she's also a bitch at first, but at least she grows on you. Alex is just always pseudo douchebag. Public watering, $50 fine. <laughs> hey, at least I didn't check the trash can in front of somebody. <laughs> Tegan, just going around town making stuff wet for no reason. You didn't know that's how you get a bigger house if you just water it? I did not know that. Goof troop, like the show? Hawk, hi! Sorry I missed you. Hmm, if it weren't for these horrendous clothes, you might actually be pretty. Actually, never mind. <laughs> Ugh, you're lucky that you grow up, Haley. You gave Haley an egg and she hated Yeah, Haley is only flowers. Oh, a stranger! My name's Vincent! Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Vincent, listen to your mother. Oh, aren't you exactly how I imagined? But that's okay. Oh, oops, read that totally wrong. That is totally the opposite of what she said. <laughs> you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Nice to meet you, Jody. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farm around could really change things. Do we think we'll still meet Marnie? Marnie is hard to find sometimes. She loves coconut and cakes too. Okay, I haven't really gotten many coconuts. Freaking Marnie! Damn it! You better be going to the pub tonight. And it's funny because most people are neutral with eggs. Like if you give that to them, they're just like, oh thanks. And it doesn't hurt anything, but it helps just like a small amount, but not Haley. Oh, I forgot, um, what's his nuts, the little poet on the beach. Hopefully Clint shows up tonight, too. Gus! Well, hello there, I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Welcome to the saloon. Can I get you anything? He's one that just keeps repeating. Yeah, okay. Emily, oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Thanks, Emily. I had no idea. I thought you were just hanging out. I also love that I can just walk behind the bar and he doesn't care. Like, I literally just moved here and he's like, sure, come on back. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out while you could, Jim. Hey, Val. How are you? JJ? Or yeah. Yeah, yeah, JJ. Or Midge. Also, my first playthrough, I had to stop myself from romancing Thane because I had to tell... Thane. Shane. Because I had to tell myself, like, no, you can't fix him. Let him be. 
I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Well, because I want you to like me. That's why. I don't like eggs. Someone threw them at you a few years ago. Damn, Dom. I love eggs. Eggs don't love me back, but I love eggs. Er, hi, I'm Clint. <laughs> I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. All right. 21 out of 28. So we need Linus, Demetrius, and Sebastian. We got Penny. I don't think the wizard counts for this, does he? Um, I'm just seeing if Linus is going to be out. That someone was your friend. Great friend. There's only 11 chairs. Yeah, most people stand. Hey, a stranger? Hello. My headcanon for Linus is that he was actually like a billionaire and he gave it all up. Almost like a Siddhartha moment. He gave it all up because he wasn't happy. And he wanted to try to find happiness with the land. You know, I feel like that's a billionaire move. And everyone judges him. Oh, Sebastian's out! Hey! I like Sebastian. Oh, you just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you chose Pelican Town. <laughs> okay, judgy. All right, so we just need... Um... Oh... Wait, it didn't count line. Oh, no, it did. It did. It did. Okay. I forgot about him on the beach. Demetrius. The wizard does count towards us. All right. Cool. I think I'm just going to go. Well, I guess I can check the. The leading one is that he was the former CEO of Joja Mart. Oh. I'm glad I wasn't too far off with that little headcanon theory. I think it makes the most sense. So I'm just gonna run down to the beach because obviously I can't <clears throat> clean any more of my farm because I have no energy. So I might as well just see if there's any stuff to pick up. And... There isn't. Well, that's all right. Hey, how are you? Silva. So Marnie is always a nightmare to get to. Because her shop hours are the worst. <laughs> and then on Tuesday, she goes and works out. So I guess I can check her working out. The energy bar is the main one. Uh, yeah, seriously. The bane of all playthroughs. And then it's nice that when the spa opens up or whatever that is, that it refills your energy bar, but it's so slow. <laughs> so slow. Um, I am just going to make a couple of these. Just, I know I need the wood for other things, but it's a little dark. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Uh, where do I want to put this? <clears throat> Alright, now we have at least a little light. Little light! I should have put one in here. Yeah, Jonathan, I always do the paths into the town. Like, both the upper and sideways path. And then I always forget the lower one because I always clear out my farm like way late. They are in good humor today. Um, but then I always try to have them around my house too so that it's kind of easier to see. Willie's back! Just got back from my fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Let's go get our fishing pole. First we need to... Oops, I already have my water. We need to water our plants. 
Oh, I guess I had no energy, but I could have just gone and gotten rid of the freaking grasses. Oh well. So once these grow, I need to start farming in the actual farmland part of the farm so that I can use my sprinklers and not have to worry about this. Because when you have to water everything by hand, it takes all your energy and then you have no energy for the rest of the day. <laughs> So how many of you suffer from the Sunday scaries? Look at that, we almost had just enough water for everything. Perfect. I should get in the habit of filling the water bowl too because I'm always really bad at that and my poor pet always goes thirsty. <laughs> Sounds like really Willie has a rod for you. I always take torches from the mine because they're free. Like I love to do that too. And then even if my pockets get full, I hold on to them and I refuse to let them go because I'm like, I need these. Okay, let's explore our farm a little bit. So Mel said to walk around everywhere because there's always lots of goodies dropped. So we need to make sure we add that to our routine. Oh, there's my mushroom. Okay, mushroom cave is easy to get to. Marnie's shop doesn't open until... Wait, what the hell? How do I get there? Wait. Does this build a bridge when I unlock the greenhouse? Oh, no, I can just walk over this. Oh, weird. Oh, here's Grandpa Shrine. <gasps> I love this. This is so cute. Lazla, wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. Grandpa. Barely know what day it is. Yeah, same. Streaming has helped so much with that because for a while there, I was like, I don't freaking know. Oh, here it is. Okay, cool, cool. Oh my god, but we need all the up. <laughs> Rude. Well, okay. They're like, we're gonna give you some, but you're not gonna be able to use it for a while yet. Oops. All right, Marnie's shop is open, let's go. What kind of vegetables am I gonna grow? Oh, whoa, where is this? <gasps> so many things to explore. Wait, how do I get to Marnie's? <gasps> Over a bridge? Ooh, oh, that's not a bridge. This is so weird. What the hoink? Is this how you get to Marnie's? Oh my goodness, that's so weird! I love it! <laughs> I'm gonna farm rocks for a little while. Uh, right now I have turnips and one potato and one cauliflower. Marnie! Oh, frick, it's Tuesday. She's working out. Damn it! <laughs> so bad at that. You can find mystery boxes by shaking trees. faster ah mayor lewis told me you just arrived i'm marnie listen marnie i just want you and lois to love each other just stupid lewis i sell livestock and animal care products at my ranch i would love to but you're never open you're never there you're never there you're never there let's go pick up our rod oh there's a quest I'm gonna just talk to people as I see them. Come back. Oh, are you wearing makeup? <laughs> I'm bored. Okay, Haley, fuck off. Bitch! You're just jealous of my rugged looks. Lewis! Alright, screw it. He's too far away now. Let's go meet Willie. I hope you're having fun with your playthrough of Stardew. Uh, best leafy go? I'm sure I butchered that, but. <laughs> Willie! Ahoy there, miss! 
heard there was a newcomer in town. You know Willie just reeks. You know Willie is the smelliest of the villagers. Of the townsfolk. I am playing this on PC. It was a good haul. A lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. All right, Willie. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the Ardo fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. <laughs> the graphics remind me of those Pokemon games you play on the Game Boy Advance. I love the art style. How many consoles do I have besides PS5? Um, lots of them. <laughs> it, you know, it's easy to justify buying them because it's my job to be able to play everything, so. My shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. Also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells! <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say, anyway. Yeah, and with a mix of B.O., because you know he doesn't quite bathe as much as he should. You know what I mean? Heck yeah! <laughs> Maxwell. Um, but, Geron, to answer your question, I have the PS5, I have the Xbox Series X, I have the PS4, and the last generation of Xbox. Ooh, nice, we can go to a museum now. I still have my Xbox 360. I have a Nintendo Switch. I have a Steam Deck. Um, Mr. Light has the PlayStation Portal. He has the... The Steam Deck... Not the Steam Deck. The Nintendo... Oh, I have the Switch Lite. He has the regular Switch. Yeah. And then... I mean, so we both... We have double of every console you named. Yeah. Because we, we both have to right. have our own. I have my Game Boy Advance SP. So do I. He has his and his regular just Game Boy Advance. I have two PlayStation 2s in the house for some reason. I don't know why. Um, I have the PlayStation 4 that is the Uncharted Edition that I bought for my brother. We have a lot oh, of consoles. I have the, this actually, this play, this Worse plays over 40 different PlayStation 1 games. We have pretty this cool. mini PlayStation 1. They're all just built into the game. Pretty, pretty oh, cool. Elliot. I live on the beach in the cabin. Um, I have the gray switch light, I think. Yeah, which, to be honest, I prefer to the one that I have. I like the smaller one. <gasps> I shoot, I only have one row. I forgot about that. I need a backpack upgrade. Do I have a Nintendo 8-bit? I do not. Oh no, the museum! Hey, see, how are you? Abysmal! Not a single piece in the entire collection. What's this? You found something? Let me see. Remarkable, it's very old. I'd love to study this in greater detail, but it is yours. Oh, shit. I got a favor to ask you. Would you consider donating any new artifacts or minerals that you find? We can make a groundbreaking discovery together. Oh, and who knows? If you keep donating, I might come across some interesting items to send your way. Arthur Morgan over here. Think about it, will you? If you decide to donate, just bring the objects to the front desk. Okay, so now we need to decide how we want to organize our museum. So we got the the little hand fan. So do we organize it by color? Do we organize it by what it is? What's How are you feeling? Have you ever had the PlayStation 2 or PlayStation 3? Um I had a PlayStation 2. I never had a PlayStation 3. Yeah, we went with the 360 that generation. Yeah. We at that point in our lives were not able to have both consoles so we were we got the xbox 
You go by what it is. So like, we'll put artifacts, like this is a fan. So this is like an artifact in this room. This kind of looks like a little artifact room. We can also pick them up and move them as we go. So it's not like it's permanent. So that's fine. I'm so bad at this. <laughs> Use fertilizer. I want to, but it's not sold yet. Fruit trees take a whole season. Crops will die as soon as the season ends, unless they grow multiple seasons. And some crops need to be harvested with a scythe. Jazz, let me meet you in a non-creepy way. Hi. Okay, what do we have left? Uh, shit. 27 out of 28. So do we have to meet the freaking wizard? The wizard? The wizard. Oh, Demetrius, duh. Duh. Lightweight farming, heck yeah, Joshua. How are you? Do you think his interesting items are in his pants? <laughs> oh, we should talk to Clint while we're here. I'm bad at gifting, so I try to make sure that I at least talk to everybody every day because I'm bad at actually gifting them items that I know they like <laughs> because I just forget. So I'll like obsess with one person and I'll just gift them an item I know they like every time I can and then forget about everybody else. So I have to at least talk to everybody. Oh, you're not in a good mood. I said I'm not in a good mood. What do you want? Okay, Abigail, we're not romancing you. Fuck. <laughs> we have to get a largemouth bass. Is that um, the lake or the river? I gotta look that up. I always forget where each fish is. Ooh, I think Haley likes daffodils. <gasps> For me? Thank you. Yeah, that's right, Haley. You're right. You like me now, don't you? Oh, I just Grim reaper her. I never know if there's a point to clear these out, but it's satisfying. Do not give that bitch an egg. <laughs> oh my God, so many daffodils. I hate having small inventory. Demetrius! How are you? Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Mario? She's interested to meet you. Yeah, I met her. I know you're gonna try to hook us up soon. Um. Okay, so I guess I should, I want these. But I should go drop stuff off of my farm first. <laughs> Maxwell. <laughs> Honestly, the lot of you. Ah, oh, shit. You know what? I was going to say well met when we started the stream and I forgot. Well met, traveler. I have not come to ridicule, ridicule you, Linus. I can give him a muscle. Can I offer you an egg in these trying times? Hi, be my friend. Here's an egg. Do you freaking imagine if someone actually did that? I would totally act like Haley. <laughs> Some stranger that just moved into town came up to me, introduced themselves, and then gave me an egg. I'd be like, bitch, what? Get away. What'd you say about a train? Um. Thank you, Cody. <laughs> Throw it at me. Are you the real lightweight or not? I am the real lightweight. Tis I. <laughs> it's all legs from lightweight. Tex, the second I meet you in person, I'm introducing myself with an egg. Hello, Tex. Take my chicken egg. You're donating all your eggs, thanks, Tom. 
We'll be fast friends. Uh, shit. I gotta look up where to get a... Deal! <laughs> I have to look up where to get... What do I need? A largemouth bath. Boss. A largemouth boss. Give someone a gift. Oh. Largemouth. All right. You were watching me play GTA 4 and The Walking Dead? Heck yeah, I hope you were enjoying those playthroughs. I appreciate that. You'll make her very sick. I freaking eat eggs every day and every day they make me sick. But do I keep eating them? I do indeed. Because I like to be in pain, apparently. All right, fishies. Where are you at? Oh, they're there. Chapter five, fishing. This book is so freaking cute. You do not understand. Look at this. This is the fish section. It tells you all of the fishies and where to get them. And when. Um, largemouth bass is a lake fish, so I should be able to get one here. Lemons, let's go fishing. Reese, it's from um, Fan Gamer. I cannot recommend it enough. I love it. It's so cute. And it comes with a little bookmark in the inside of the dust jacket. Let me take this off. Uh oh, shit. Oh, it's the the bar is so small. You forget how how small it is when you start. Nice. Um inside the dust jacket has all of the gifts people like as a little poster. It's really cute. Jaron, would your wife want you sharing that info with us? <laughs> oh my god. What the frick? <laughs> Just axe in the lake. Jonathan, I'm technically allergic to eggs too, but um, not in the way that like gives me hives, in the way that gives me an intolerance. So I eat eggs, and then it's no bueno. Damn it, Carp, I don't need you. That's gonna open a conversation. <laughs> now nah, it's done there. Okay, Jaron, I know she doesn't know, but if she wouldn't like it, you still shouldn't share it. Cause her of swelling? Oof. So I can, I am technically just allergic to the protein in the yolk. So I can eat egg whites. Um, but who wants to spend money on egg whites? And who wants to use the effort of just getting the egg whites? A chub! It might be too late now for the bass. I should check. Have any of you ever completed selling every item? God damn it, carp. All the flavors, yeah, yeah seriously. All oh, that tasty cholesterol. Everyone's talking about eggs, but yep. <laughs> um. Oh, shoot. They were done at 7. All right. I got to get this tomorrow then, I guess. Okay. Did we... Who do we need to talk to today? Who do we miss? We missed Harvey, but we're not going to get him now because he won't be at the pub. Leah might. Caroline won't. Pierre won't. Evelyn won't. Yeah. Frick it. We missed a lot of people. Oh, well. We'll get, we'll get who we can. Nice, Light Sidious. Um, he streams over there on Tuesdays and Thursdays and Saturdays. Get a comment? Yeah, Light Sidious said he followed you on Twitch. Hell yeah. Way to be. And Saturdays. I don't love eggs, but it's one of the easiest ways to get vitamin D. I actually am obsessed with eggs. I will have, if I can, I will have an egg and cheese sandwich every morning. <laughs> to a whole 75 followers now. Woo! Taking what? the world by storm. What do you want? Go away. Fine, Jane, but you will love me. I'm not going to romance you, but I will get you to love me. 
Hey guys, give me another round. <laughs> Can't eat eggs after people called it chicken period? Oh god. How'd I miss you? Ooh, I've got new ideas to sleep on. I love when I get that pop up. Probably pointless to go fishing since I only have one slot, but it's fine. <laughs> what are we gonna get? Well, we can save it for Leah. Um, so Light Sidious is the Ethan Atwell over on Twitch. So when we see that, we'll have to remember. Hmm? Light Sidious is the Ethan Atwell on Twitch. So oh, we'll have nice. to. I don't need that anyways. Perfect. Yeah, I definitely need to line this it's dock over here. Alright, so we're going to sell... I know... I think I need one carp at least for the donation. And I think I might need a chub too. But we're going to sell one of those. And I think... You know it was a guy too. I'm going to sell one of these oysters too. And we'll sell one of these leaks. I like to sell one of everything just to get it on the... I'll save that and give that to Leah tomorrow. It's getting late already? Oh, man. That was a fast day. There's always so much to do on these first days, and I feel like I never am um, capable of doing it efficiently. <laughs> All right, level one foraging. We can make a field snack. Oh, we're rich. 138 gold. Oh, it's Wednesday. We need our recipe. Oh, wait. Oh, Sundays are recipe days. Oh, they're perturbed today. Thanks, Reese. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. It is not affordable. That shit is expensive. All right. Let's, um, at least we don't have to water our plants today. That's nice. It's Wednesday, so I can't buy more crops. So we need to get our small, our, we need to get our bass. So let's go focus on that first. I love rainy days in this game. When did you first become a lightweight? Um, always. I've always known I was lightweight. So the, the s joke is that I got drunk off of one margarita at Chili's, which is true. And that's when I got the courage to start the channel. And I never started the channel because I didn't think I was a good enough gamer. So when I was drunk, I was like, oh my god, I'm a lightweight. And I was like, that will be my shtick because I'm a, I'm not great at gaming either. And I'm not great at drinking. So I'm a lightweight gamer. So on five years ago, this month, the idea was born. So I guess I knew I was a lightweight five years ago. Okay, fair. Half a margarita. <laughs> Half a margarita. Did you see Chili's called me a queen? I was like, oh, thanks. Sponsor me. A third of a margarita. Maxwell, you weren't there. Stop calling me out. We 
it just went back and it sucked. Yeah, it was not good. Sorry, Chili's. Another chub! <laughs> Legend has it, she's still drunk for that margarita. <laughs> You'll never know. Listen, chili strawberry margaritas with sugar on the rim, they're good shit right there. Ah, oh, Chubbs, I don't need you. Ooh, a geode. New Age, the goal of Stardew is technically to rebuild the community center, which we haven't unlocked yet. Um, but really, it's like one of those games that's never ending. So you can stop playing after you beat the community center because that's kind of like, I think, the main quest line. Um, but there's also a museum to collect pieces for. There are like two side zones that you can do stuff for. Um, so I guess that's technically the goal, but the goal is really just to have fun. <laughs> Come back! No! <gasps> we got it! All right, Linus needs it. Lucky he's right here. Give her one margarita and she'll start it. Oh my god, he's going to the bathroom. Do not go over there and give him a fish. I've never seen that before. Guys, he's taking a piss. Are you taking a piss? Linus? What if I... <laughs> what if I give you this fish? first but he definitely didn't wash his hands ah! no! Linus no oh man public watering fine $50 yeah Reese it was not I I used to freaking love chilies it was not good do not go to chilies I'm sorry, well, Chili's. It, was, it could just be that location. Okay, fair. It could be our, loca our location. Oh my god, I hate when they just do the repeat dialogue and you can keep clicking on them. <gasps> Ooh. Sebastian! He's always so hard to find. I had really good luck. Oh shit, Maro's in her room. I can't go in there yet. We've been doing so well. I can't wait till we get the tickets. The tickets make me so excited. To be fair, I don't think he ever washed his hands. Actually, he takes a bath in that lake. <laughs> he's cleaner than Willy. Unless he was touching his Willy to go to the bathroom. Then he's not. But normally he is. He left it flailing. Blech. Put that shit away. That's not the fish I want to see. If you weren't a girl, I'd ask you to play catch. I'm fine with just watching you play from distance. I'm not Haley, bitch, please. I want to play catch with you. I want to be angry, but I also don't want to piss him off because I do need to get his hearts up so that I can see all of the freaking cutscenes. Will this hurt my um heart status with him? The enchiladas were really good at Chili's. So was the um, buffalo chicken salad. And I'm not a huge salad person. That shit was good. And then their, I called them their cheese curds, but I forget what they were. Their Southwest cheese bites were phenomenal. Yeah, those did slap. They don't have any of those now. That was like our pre-movie meal whenever we go to the movies. Mm -hmm. We're actually going to a local barbecue place. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Reese, you will just be the ultimate lightweight tomorrow. Oh, shoot. I should have kept a leak for... Oh, no. He likes spring onions. All right. I need to find Leah and give her this stick. <laughs> Leah, take my stick. <laughs> I 
Dom Dom, are you saying four years for um, how long you've you've been doing? What does what did you say it was? Jujitsu that you do? Howdy, Captain. How are you? Start your time. Thank you all for hanging out with me during this. I wasn't sure if you guys would really enjoy it, but I'm loving just the relaxed vibes of this. Do I really? Yep. Nice. There's just no pressure with Stardew because there's no like right or wrong way to play it. You don't have to worry about fucking things up because if you miss something, you just do it the next day. Hey, what do you think my new song should be about? Trains! <clears throat> A city in the sea. I like that. Hey, you know what? That sounds perfect. You're welcome. I know, I'm good at this shit. Did I get the trash can already? Yeah, I did. Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, nice. Gui, did I see you ask if he knew um, Gracie? Funny story, I actually know Gracie IRL. <laughs> well, my dad does. I met him once when I was a kid. If that's what you're talking about. And if not, Ignore my comment. You played trains last night and your friend did a recount of the score last night after I left. You were actually third. Heck yeah. All right, let's go try to talk to the wizard. We haven't talked to him yet. Oh, I can't forget the traveling merchant on Fridays either. Your sister's name is Grace? Nice. Fridays and Sundays. Thanks, Reese. I'll definitely need that reminder. Oh, shit. Do you remember the first live stream you ever did and what were your thoughts going into it? My first live stream ever was actually a GTA wrap-up video. GTA 5. That was craziness. And... 700 people in the stream. I don't know if you guys could hear that, but my very first stream, we had 700 people in it. <laughs> we have not gotten those numbers again. <laughs> that was insanity. That was when YouTube still promoted you. And I was fucking nervous. Nervous. Oh, he has to invite us, right? Thanks, Reese. He is a diva. I love the music in his little tower, though. So good. All right, let's um, spend the rest of the time clearing out the farm, I guess. Because we'll need some... Some space here. And shaking some trees, because if we can get the mystery boxes from them, we'll want to do that. Oh my god, Froggy, I'm sorry. I just demolished your home. My bad. just so simple and satisfying to clear all this shit out. Do -do -do -do. Music, come back! You should charge peeps. Your streams are like therapy. Ah, thanks! No, you, streaming with you guys makes me so happy. So, so happy. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Oh, we got four? Oh my god, that was the most toned up I've ever sounded in my entire freaking life. What the hell? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> <clears throat> Anyways. Oh, we missed Clint. I could have done that. Uh, we'll do that tomorrow. Oh, I still didn't find Leah. Shit. I went down there to go find Leah, and then I got distracted. Per usual. Do we think she's in our house still? 
Guys, I get so turned around now. Wait, where, where am I going? This way. This way looks right. There's going to be so much hardwood on this farm. Holy crap. Oh, I'm going to make down here my little orchard. Guys, I have visions for this. You don't have anything to say? Maxwell, thank you. Appreciate you. My friend's wife always wins train games. She was drunk and I stole her normal color and she still won. <laughs> I just got stuck in a bush. I just put a Linus. His friend's wife always wins the train games? Nice. It's Leo, where are you? Are you on the beach? Shit, she might be on the beach, but it's raining. Would she be on the beach in the rain? What's her schedule? I don't know her schedule. <laughs> Jonathan, I love how you have mastered the art of making the joke without saying the joke. Phrasing. Oh, I can go get this little guy. Boop. Get my scythe back out because we don't want to accidentally give somebody something. I've done that way too many times. Leah, are you here? <gasps> Where'd you go? I don't know her schedule. Oh, another fan. Shoot. Guess I should not have picked that up yet. What are the odds we get two fans already? Ooh. Three days to grow. We can do that. Oh, shoot. We had to plan for Mayor Lewis's birthday. That was on Sunday, wasn't it? Today would be a good day to explore the mines, except they're not open yet. Sunday. Okay. I know he likes peppers, but I don't have any of those. So does he like foraged goods? <laughs> Guess what her name meant? Um, I don't know what. What did it mean? All right, let's get rid of that. We'll save this dandelion. We'll sell that horseradish. Oh my God, there's crumbs on this mat. That's so annoying. I hate that. I hate it. Leah often hangs around the river in the pond in the forest, but villages change her schedule around rain. Yeah. I don't know where she would be in the rain. Camel Freak, thank you so much. Always forget to ask you, but are you planning on playing any of the Fallout games? Camo, I, or, I'm sorry. I, why do I still do that? I know it doesn't say Camo. I apologize. <laughs> um, I would love to play the Fallout games. I have played them all before at least once besides 76. Um... I just don't know. I just don't know when. Maybe when the update comes out for Fallout 4. Although I will tell you, I will lose my shit if someone tells me, you should play New Vegas instead because Fallout 4 is trash. Because it ain't, actually. Oh, I should shake some trees, huh? Try to get these boxes. Hello, Foxy. Blackbeard is the female of the show. Oh my god, Maxwell. I'm so glad the Fallout show got renewed for season two. They did such a good job. I know, I can't wait to keep watching it. We are family. Exactly, Jonathan. Exactly. Shake, shake, shake. Comet Pizza Parlor. Exactly the beer. They'll say it's trash and then they'll put so much, so many hours in. Now, I will say I had a lot of complaints when I first played it. But upon replay, I realized I was just being a dum-dum. 
slash they fixed things that annoyed me. <laughs> like, I was trying to get all the achievements on Xbox for it when I played it the first time. And um, the only one that I needed, the only achievement I had left was to get a perfect settlement score. And the settlement that I started building in, I got it to, like, one level down from the max score. I don't remember if the max score was, like, 10 or whatever, but... Let's say it was 10. It was at 9, and I could not get it up to 10 for the life of me. And turns out that that location was glitched, and you couldn't get it to a perfect score there. So I had to rebuild my settlement in a new spot. Which, if you did settlement building, you know that was not an easy feat. And I was pissed. But I did it. And then I never played the DLCs. So Fallout 4 could be a good one to play, because the DLCs would be a first playthrough. Maybe, oh, it's midnight anyway, so I was going to say, maybe I should make some more torches and line the pathways. Another settlement needs our help is the worst thing about, yeah, that's true. Heck yeah. Plus one rod proficiency. <laughs> Thanks, Linus. <laughs> I forgot about that, Foxy. That is a good point. That was annoying. <laughs> this one's for you folks living in Stardew Valley. Check for spring onion. Okay, we need to get that because George loves spring onions. They're somewhat annoyed today. Nice, Reese. Um, I don't remember. I think I bought, I think they were having a big sale before Starfield came out. And I think I bought them all. Like the gold edition, maybe? I'm not sure. I'll have to double check. How are you not just instantly happier when you hear this song? See, this is the perfect Chase the Sunday Scary game. Chase the Sunday Scaries Away game. Ooh, the nice thing about this farm is I can just go right here and get some water. And I'm never gonna have to worry about getting a well. Although, that's not true, because the farmland at the bottom I might want one. I'm not sure. We'll see. Not that they're expensive. Alright, what is our goal for today? We still need our parsnip. We should break the geodes. Try to give Leah our stick. We need to figure out what Lewis likes that I have. I love that you are watering plants with seawater and it's no big deal. <laughs> They're salt water plants. Duh. All right, Lewis. What do you like? Lewis likes hot pepper, green tea, vegetable medley, glazed yams, autumn's bounty. Cool. Can't do anything. Uh, any of those. He likes coconut, cactus, fruit, and blueberries. Can't do any of those. So what are our universal likes? Can I do any of those? Universally liked most flowers. Oh, I can give him a flower. But does he like flowers that I find on the ground? That is the question. Hmm. Well, maybe I can buy him something from Gus. Does Gus sell any of those? Vegetable medley glazed yams on a bounty. I don't think he does. Damn. Which veggies are universally liked? Are turnips? Um. Nope. Of course not. <laughs> Of course not. 
Oh well, that's what he's getting, because that's all I got. Nafisa, I'm doing well. How are you? 7.10 in the morning. Well, happy Monday for you. I hope you have a great week. Welcome to our chat. New crashing servers in the dev room is still accessible. Old Nintendo vibes. I can see that. Spring Onion is down at the bottom, right? A parsnip. Oh wait, I'm growing parsnips or turnips? What am I growing? Oops, it's not nine yet. What do you want? Leave me alone. No, I won't. You can't make me. Nafisa, this is Stardew Valley. Um, it is a nice little indie game from Concerned Ape. And you can play it on PC or Mac much or consoles. Yeah, pretty much everything. Actually. Penny, you get as carried away as you want. Nobody home. <gasps> A baguette! Maybe Lewis will like my baguette. You've never met a farmer before, Jody. Please. Please! <laughs> Jonathan says, Concerned Ape is of no relation. <laughs> you bet he'll eat your baguette. Leah! Let me give you this stick! <laughs> Please. So are the spring onions out today? Don't know. Mark, no worries at all. I'm glad you can be here. And also no pressure if you want to just go do something else since you just got off work. <laughs> It's super easy to woo if you have a goat. Make goat cheese and she goes crazy for it. Ooh, good to know. Chat, we have to figure out who we're romancing, but I do want to romance everyone up to a certain point or like date everybody at, so I can see all of the cutscenes because I've never done that before. And then we'll choose who to marry. Bitches do love goat cheese. It's me. I'm bitches. Highly recommend the um, goat cheese wrapped in blueberries or cranberries from Aldi. And she loves wine. Sounds like a lady I'd like to woo. Mark, I'm with you. Now I want cheese too. She should be by the lake back there. All right, let me go see. I just am tired of carrying the stick around. <laughs> Taking up precious inventory space. I thought she was usually by the river or the lake, or sometimes she's at the beach, right? What are the benefits of romancing someone? Um, you can marry them and then have children. And depending on who you marry, depends on like what kind of stuff they'll give you. So there's that. But also it's just because it's more like it's just cute and you watch their character story, like their character develop and their story develop, and you learn more about them as you, let me show you. So you have this like little heart bar. I, I always max out my heart bar with Linus first because he's just the easiest. <laughs> um, so you have these hearts, you can give everybody two gifts a week and you can talk to everybody every day, at least once. 
Um, and then when they reach certain heart thresholds, different like cutscenes or things will happen. And then some people you can date. So if they say single, you can romance them. So you can't romance everybody. Uh, and then if you get married, you can... Oh wait, no, these are for dating, right? Because you can 10 star, 10 heart everybody. Linus is a cheap date. He's just so easy because it's just foraged. He loves anything foraged. Ooh, Jonathan, I can see. I can see that for sure. Mark, you will not get any judgment from me for just eating a hunk of cheese. <laughs> I already talked to Jody today. Oh, I can give you, I think you like dandelions. <gasps> You'll be baking cookies? Yeah, give me a recipe. How nice of you, dear. She didn't love that. She didn't love that, but she's too nice to say so. Oh, I forgot about my AG codes. I'm the worst at this. I get so distracted. <laughs> Why do so many of you have these seeds in your trash cans? The clouds look great today. Like scoops of vanilla. I missed her? Go down? Where? Reese, I also like the fact that she lives alone. <laughs> like she actually owns her own place. Sam still lives with his parents. Well, with his aunt. No, Sam lives with his parents. Shane lives with his aunt. Lawrence, where is she? The other way? The beer, I am. I'm gonna date them all. Keep going. Follow the river. <laughs> okay, back, back, back. There's a delay. There's a delay. Thank you, Joel. I did them just for this because my character has little ones like this in the forest. The delay is a real problem. She's probably not even here anymore. Where is she? She is not here. I did not miss her. <laughs> is she over here? There's a squirrel. I missed my chance. Damn it. We need a bell on her like the freaking goat in Witcher. Well, maybe she's in her house now. She does go to the tavern sometimes. Mm. All right, it's fine. I already missed my geode opening too. Got Arthur to die in good honor. Nice, Mark. I like your RDR2 playthrough. I love that game. Played the story three times. Nice! Well, if you can, join us on streams on Show Trainer House 730. Okay. We stream Red Dead on Mondays and Wednesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern time. If you are interested in watching those. Hello, Lazla. Are you well? I am well. Thank you for asking. One of these days, my geodes will be opened. <laughs> but not today! Of course. <laughs> That's one thing the book doesn't have. Like online they have their schedules, but the book does not have their schedules, which is odd. I guess, um, what did Pierre want again? A parsnip. 
Ramsey, we can raise chickens. You're in luck. We'll have to figure out the theme of the animals. The animal names. Um, okay, I should go back to Leah now. We tried, folks. You know what's gonna happen too? The second I put this freaking driftwood in my inventory, we're gonna find her. Yeah, she's at the tavern some nights. But not tonight. How are you gonna talk to Shane today? Okay, so today was definitely the least productive day. But that's okay. They don't all have to be productive. It's about the journey. We're in no rush. Reese, I'm about to steal your girl. Nice, can't see me. Can I call you John Cena? I hope you've enjoyed them. Guys, I want some cheese now. We do have a lot of energy still, so I guess I could... Um, work on clearing some more of my farm. Can't <laughs> steal anybody's girl. Everyone just wants cheese now. It's true, we do. Cheese weight gaming. Hey Gerald, happy Sunday! Or Monday for you, if it's Monday. Why, because Kylie's not real? <laughs> uh, 305, this is Stardew Valley. 305? It's okay. Correct, Ramsey. Um, Mr. Light has a YouTube channel that I co stream on with him. Like, I sit in the chair over there. Yeah. But I do not have... Well, I have one, but I never stream on it yet. That will be the goal to eventually co-stream on. But, um... Not there yet. But if you're interested in seeing more of us on Twitch, you can follow Mr. Light's channel, which is Mr. Underscore Lightweight over on Twitch. 305 says hi. Oops. What? Oh god. Lost track of my energy there. Um What do we want to do? Well, it's probably late enough where you could go to bed. Um I need to what are the hours that I need to go to the community center to trigger that? Got it? Nice. Just got emotional damage. Oh. They're in good humor today. I will break my geodes. <gasps> we get our kitty. Use this as ASMR. Nice. And our parsnips are done. Will I adopt this cat? What if you say no? Do you actually not get to adopt it? Okay. What's her name? She kind of looks like... <laughs> Throw out your name ideas for me, would ya? Jake, thank you so much! I really appreciate that. Luna? Sweet. 
so awesome to see how far you've come since I first started watching you with your Metro Exodus playthrough. Damn. Holy shit! Wow! <laughs> Moonlight! Oh, that's cute. Hermione. Skyrim? Ooh, I should do a Skyrim name. Um... Like a Nern root. <laughs> Jake, thank you so much for the support. I really do appreciate that, and thank you for popping in. Jinx is cute. Lord Farquaad. Taco Cat. <laughs> Goat cheese pizza. No, when we have our when we have our like coop. We'll do, we'll do each chicken. Taco, cat, goat, cheese, pizza. Loki? Oh, Loki's cute. Can you please pray for my cousin? She had a stroke. Oh, Mo, I'm so sorry. Sending all my positivity towards her. Alright, we'll go... Name the cat, Dan. Hold on, let's do a... A pull. I hate that it does that. Kitty cat. <laughs> um, we had moonlight. I don't know how many of these I can add. Moonlight, moonlight, moonlight. Amarantha. Oh, we could do another. Wait, wait. She's a white cat. Manon has white hair. Read the Assassin's Blade series. Do it! Well, little Manon! Okay, so we'll do either the chicken coop or the she or the um cow pen will be moon themed. So we'll come up with various moon um moon names. So we can do Luna, Moonlight, uh, Stardust. So I guess not moon themes, but you know what I mean. Astronomy. And then the chicken ones will be, <laughs> I'm sorry, Mel. <laughs> um, the chicken ones can be taco cat, goat cheese pizza. Mel, I will name a cow Moonlight, I promise. It'll be a white cow. We're gonna have a, an astronomy barn. You paid your ticket, good job. Proud of you. Now don't get another one. Or I'll have lemons time you out. You hear me? Mama Light's putting her foot down. To our valued Jojo Mart customers, our team members have removed the landslide caused by our drilling operation near the mountain lake. I'd like to remind you that our drilling operation is entirely legal. Responsible stewardship of the local environment is our top priority. We apologize for any inconveniences accident may have caused. As always, we value your continued support and patronage, Morris. Shut up, Morris. No one likes you. All right. So, does Lewis like parsnips? I think these are universally liked. So, I think that maybe we save at least one parsnip for him. And we have one gold parsnip that I cannot sell. I need that one. And then I need another one for the community center. And then I'll save the silver one for Lewis. And then I'll sell the rest. Well, maybe I'll keep like five of them. I'll keep six of them. So today our goal is to buy some more parsnip, seed, parsnip seeds. Because we need to get that money. We need to open up the geode. And we need to give Leah the stick. And maybe we'll give Haley another daffodil because that's easy. And we have to water the rest of our plants. The music stopped again. Come back. Music, come back. 720. Okay. Get that money, honey. Dom Dom! 
That's it. Lemons, mute him. I warned him. I warned him. No ticket, because you... How, how did you get pulled over if your brother was the one speeding? Dom Dom. Maxwell, I don't have any grapes yet. I think they're fall. What an eyesore. I can adopt more cats in the version? Oh, okay, lemons, thanks. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now, just look at it, it's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. Listen, Lewis, I feel called out. I feel called out! But to be fair, the community sucks, it's a scary place. But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. You are an old fool, because you won't just love freaking Marnie. Just, you're a freaking mayor of a 10 person town. That pisses me off. I hate that so much. Georgia Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Time could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of, relics of the past. Oh well. If anyone else buys a JoJo Co. membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. Every gamer lowers their head in shame. No, I'm holding my head proudly. <sighs> Here, let's go inside. June and most. June and most. June and most. Wait. Wait. Because like a Virgin River situation, we were tired of the corporate grind, and our grandpa said when we get tired of the corporate hamster wheel, he had a present for us. And we opened the letter, and he said, hey, here's his old rundown house. Move in. Oh, nice. Look at it. Nice. I have a fourth one, but Baby Light took it somewhere, and I don't know where that somewhere is. Uh-oh, this one's invisible. I have an invisible Junimo. That is the coolest. That is the coolest thing. Guys. Wait. <laughs> Three or five Dan is on Twitch. Oh yeah. How cute! Anyways, these are the Junimos. They are adorable. John Cena. <laughs> Three or five. Um, you can find him on Twitch at Mister Underscore Lightweight. I'm getting the link. That's my favorite. All right, he's putting the link in. There's also a oh, video of uh, a two minute video on there of her accidentally streaming on my channel. Here's the fourth one. The leaf is invisible. Invi invisible. I had to figure out where the chrome key is. Like, why? Easy. There I am. If you follow me, you also follow her. Again. Oh, she's on there. Hey, Ken. Is it the resident Ken? Huh? Is it resident Ken? See. Si. I guess Vincent and Jazz must have been playing in here. You have Twitch on my laptop and keep Tegan on my. <laughs> this place is even more dilapidated than I remember. Ken, you're late, sir. It's because he was so riveted from Baldur's Gate three last night. <laughs> Dom Dom, did you expect him to be nice when you were pulled over for speeding? When speeding kills people. You will get no sympathy from me. You will just get shame. Remember when I had to wear the cone of shame for losing the board game first? You get the cone of shame for speeding. You saw something? Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. You're worrying me, Lazla. Come drops. Look, I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. Okay, Lewis. <laughs> he wants to go eat some cheese. Quave, I do not have a cone of shame. Um, we got some. Lemons, is it you that had the cone of shame or was it Ken? Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can help catch that rat if you have some extra time. Sure. <laughs> You've known me for four days, but I'll I'll get right on that. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. No, we're gonna explore it now. 
Ken has the cone. No, Ken, he was just telling us the second time that he had gotten pulled over. He was recounting the story. Ken has the cone, you have the shame. <laughs> oh, this is when the wizard invites us. That was my Junimo language, in case you were wondering. <laughs> Reach farming level one and craft a scarecrow. Build a coop. Um, we might be able to build a coop already, actually. I probably have to chop some more wood, though. Let's just go see what we need for that. <laughs> dum dum. <laughs> I just have a hard time believing this story. <laughs> I'm struggling. 4,000 gold. Okay, just kidding. We're not even close to that. <laughs> I have met Sebastian. He's a cutie patootie. Robin has a hot temper. <laughs> Okay, um, shit, I need a freaking parsnip for for the Pierre. I can't talk today. You know what? One was after midnight and the second was before midnight. <laughs> so the same day. Oh, thanks, Reese. Uh, Pierre needed the... I don't think Pierre opens until noon, right? Because Pierre's the... Oh, no, that's Gus. Wait. Pierre's the store. So Pierre's open. Wow, just had a brain fart. Pierre, why do you want a parsnip? Are you about to resell my vegetables? to make sprinklers. Ten days to mature. Do I need beans for the community center? Hey, <laughs> DoorDash, single parsnip. Maybe one bean. Alright, we'll buy a couple bean starters. 
And then I'll just set them up so that I can have a, hopefully, a sprinkler that just waters them so I don't have to. Hi, Neptune. I am doing very well. How are you? Geodes. I said for like five days in a row, I'm getting the geodes. Damn it. We're doing the geodes. And we should go check for spring onions too. Limestone. Ooh. Slate. So, I don't know why this reminded me of this. And it's the dumbest story. And you guys are going to be like, why the hell did you share that? But, you know, I share too much anyways. So, we're just going to share it. Uh, <laughs> when I was in high school, my family and I were in the Adirondacks. And there was, like, this little, technically a beach on the lake. But it was tiny. And it was, like, rocky. And there was this really... I don't even know exactly how it happened. I picked up something and I was like, what the heck is this? Cause it looked weird. And my mom said, oh, it's shale. But I had never heard of like shale before. So I thought she was saying shell with an accent. And I mocked her for saying shell with a Southern accent. I was like, shale mom. And she was like, yes, shale. And now that's an inside joke for our family that you guys really didn't care about, but I told you anyway, so you're welcome. You're welcome for that. <laughs> So now anytime I see the word shale, I think shale, mom. You need all of the veggies. Shit. Okay, we'll go back and buy some more. <laughs> Samurai's like, why did you share that story? That was so dumb. <laughs> oh, shale, no. Dumb, dumb. I don't want to hear about it anymore because you're going to freak me out. Move on from the conversation. And I'm not kidding. I will freaking mute you if I hear you get another speeding ticket. Today I learned shale is a word. <laughs> now we need a shale emoji. The more you know. I know, Dom Dom. That's why you're not muted right now. Okay, how are we going to do this? So there's a shit ton of minerals. I'm thinking color-coded. We'll do silver, blue, and then we can rearrange as needed. I don't know you. Yes, you do. I've literally talked to you every day for a week. <laughs> what do you mean you don't know me? How's that spelled? Shale? <laughs> All right, let's go back to the store and buy the other plants. Two D Minecraft. I've never played Minecraft, so I don't know if that's accurate or not. So many people. Boop. It's a fine looking day. Oh, you have more to say? Are you trying to sell me on your daughter? Like, why are you up up talking her so much? You think she needs friends, probably. All right, so I already have a. Oh my god, I already have. A parsnip for it. I got some beans. I think I did one cauliflower, one potato. I haven't gotten any kale yet. We'll just do... Oh. We should do some... Flowers, too. Uh, although I don't need them yet. I don't need those for the community center, I don't think. They're really just important if I want honey. But I can still turn wild honey into the community center, so I don't know if it matters yet. Maybe I'll wait on those. <gasps> We're poor! Farming's expensive, man. Hi, Tim. How are you? Oh, we need to go to the mine soon, too, because we need to get our sword. <laughs> that was a good shell story. Thanks. <laughs> I'm glad you all enjoyed it so much. 
All right, so I have to remember to plant the beans out of the way because they're hella annoying with their freaking trellis. It's nice not having to worry about how I'm going to set these up with the uh, sprinklers, though. Not going to lie. Always trying to map that out in my head is never fun. Okay, so I have seven more. So that was four, five, six, seven. Then I have one, two, three potatoes. Oops. One, two, three, four kale seeds. I want to put, I think I'm going to put the beans down in the actual farmland. Not the beans. Yeah, the beans. What are they? Beans. They're beans. <laughs> and then I'm going to put a sprinkler there so that I don't have to worry about them. You'll just have to remind me to go harvest them because I will 100% forget. <gasps> What's this? That was my first time ever finding one of those. That was so cool. Oh, but now my freaking oh, it's gonna be uneven. It's all right. Don't worry about it. It won't last. It won't last. Uh, Beer Baron, I agree. I'm so excited to see if that kind of takes the world by storm like Stardew has. I love that it looks to be a little bit more like dark and gothic. That's really exciting to me. I don't know when, Ugh. what does my farming need to be before I can get a sprinkler? Oh, I should keep that because I have to go plant my beans. Hello, hello, welcome. How are you this fine Sunday evening? Well, I hope it's fine for you. <laughs> oh my god, this is the worst. This is the worst. I forgot about this. All these that I can't break yet. Oof. Well, this is where my beans are going to go. Oh, wait. They can go up in the top corner. Hold on. They'll go up here. Okay, so this is where my... The eventual sprinkler will go and it's just gonna be a baby sprinkler so it's just gonna be okay don't stand in there I won't be able to get out I've made that mistake before <laughs> all right cool oh but I won't be able to put my sprinkler in there oh no <laughs> damn it well I guess we're gonna be watering those every day after all Maybe it'll reach. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> You're practicing maths? Ugh! I'm sorry. I hope you enjoy that. Alright, let's go check and see if there's any spring onions. And we have our driftwood just in case Leah is there. I don't want to cut any of this down yet until I have a silo. Because I'm going to need it. Despite all my rage, I'm caught in being full. <laughs> ah. Okay, they're way down here, I think. 
I can't forget to give a parsnip to Lewis on Sunday. It won't super help, but you know, it won't hurt. <gasps> Yay! And we can give these to George. George likes himself some spring onions. There weren't very many there. Usually there's a lot right here. No parsnips on Sundays. Oh, it's Monday for you? Oh, right, right, right. Because you always watch this before school, don't you? I forgot about that. Nice, 305. No worries. Even just a follow and a, a watch when you can is great and highly appreciated. Ooh, it's hopping tonight. Oh, it's Friday. Duh. Ahoy there! Don't you have work to do? Dude, it's 9.40 on a Friday night. Don't I have work to do? Oh, this is just... Louis is just like, oh yeah, I'll talk to you. And Marnie is... Oh, she's talking to me. Normally, she's too preoccupied to talk to me. <gasps> Leah! I have your driftwood still. Hey, girl. I've got a little stick for you. <laughs> She said it has an interesting shape. <clears throat> I don't know if Linus is still going to be out, but let's go up there and check. Bum, bum, bum. Wait, we didn't talk to Linus yet, did we? Sebastian, I, f I promise I'm not following you. See? Look. I'm going ahead of you. I'm not a creeper. Lewis, what do you want to say? Oh. No! Just missed her. Wait, where's Linus? Ba -ba -ba -da. I do kind of feel bad. Oh, he's sleeping. I feel bad that we can just walk into Linus's house. <laughs> Dude's just sleeping and we're just walking in his tent. I just want to be your friend. I'm not trying to be creepy. Um, Ethan, I used to have one and it was just too much. I didn't enjoy it. Just a lot to manage. Especially now that I have a kid. Mr. Light make, might make one eventually for his um, Twitch channel, but I have too much going on. <laughs> oh, I should put my spring onion in there. I'll need my watering can tomorrow, so don't worry about that. <gasps> I didn't say hi to you yet. I'm sorry. Linus does not like sticks. Ooh, Scarecrow. Oh wait, shit, was that fertilizer too? Or was that speed grow? I didn't look. Let's see. Hello, Christian. How are you? Basic fertilizer. But I don't think I can put this on top of already planted plants, can I? Hmm. <laughs> they are neutral today. Damn it! Of course- Oh, well I can buy some more parsnips. I just need to get those gold ones because I'm the worst at getting those. Ooh, I got one at least. Alright, today is not the day for Lewis. Um...
I'll have 10 of those and I'll sell everything else. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. Rasmodius, the wizard. Beep, beep. Worms. I know they're technically sticks, but they look like worms. Ooh, our carrots are done too. Okay, keep those. Ooh. I'm going to need another... Another crate soon. Oh, I need coal. Oops. We're gonna make one of those. I do need some fertilizer. Hmm. I guess we can't really upgrade anything soon anyways, because we need 4,000, so that's not too much of a problem. Okay. Let's put... Oh, wait, we want that. And... What am I doing? The only problem is, I don't think I left myself enough sign room for a sign. Twenty-five wood for one sign? Are you kidding me? Okay, never mind. It's a lot of freaking wood. Alright, so this will be our this will be our Hmm. This one will be our plant one. And this one will be our everything but the kitchen sink one for now. I never know where to put the freaking scarecrow. Just go there. I'll need a separate one for fish eventually, but obviously I can't do that yet. And might as well make some fertilizer while we're here. How many spaces? One, two, three, four, five, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. We'll just do twenty. Guys, I just did math. I just did math! I'll be proud of me. And just like that, we are out of sap. Meet the wizard. So proud, thanks. Thanks, guys. Basic math! Woo! <laughs> yeah, fish box would smell really bad. <laughs> also phrasing. <clears throat> I just knew you were going to say something, Mr. Light, so I had to say it first. Uh, I had to I beat you to it. Some things are so painfully obvious you count a little slime. No. You, you find it the other way? Okay. This stream has been great for me. I picked up like seven followers. Hell yeah! Glad to help. The phone keeps buzzing over here. Nice. I can tell we ate an early dinner because I'm fucking hungry. Yeah, I've just been snacking on all the stuff my doctor said not to. Guys, how is it 10.30 already? Dude, time flies with this game. Let's go buy some more parsnips and go meet the wizard. The sounds of this game are so peaceful. They really are. This is just the perfect game for a Sunday evening. Oh! Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. Ooh, our first ticket! Copper ores. Okay, so we really have to go to the mines. 
We'll do that today, too. Um, oh, shoot. I have to water my beans. <laughs> Great day. Maybe we should go to the mines first. Leave my fishing pole here because I don't need that. Uh... Okay, keep everything else. So close! And that's when she realized she did math wrong. <laughs> Well, I thought that I made 20 fertilizers, and I thought I had five fertilizer remaining. <laughs> Susie had 50 watermelons. If three of her friends ate two watermelons each, how many watermelons does Susie have left? I'd like to know whoever made those math questions, because they were always the most ridiculous things. The ridiculous amounts of the ridiculous items. Like, who would have 50 watermelons? Susie, apparently. You named my your guy in Skyrim Tigorn? Yes, Maxwell. Yeah, Ken, it definitely throws me off whenever they say maths. Their thing is like there's multiple math subjects, which I get, but also math. <laughs> it was at this moment that she knew she fucked up. <laughs> it's been abandoned for decades. But a dark place undisturbed for so long, I'm afraid ore isn't the only thing you'll find. You guys are about to see how freaking god awful I am at the combat in this. It's easier to say they're wrong. Exactly. Name's Marlin, by the way. I run the Adventurer's Guild right outside. I'll keep my eye on you. Prove yourself and I might think about making you a member. Have any of you ever completed the Adventurer's Guild story? Like the... Kill this many thingies. You know what I mean? The bulletin board. Because I have not. I love, this is my favorite part of the update. Favorite part of the update. Yes, can I did? They're so cute. Okay, well, there's more. There's more copper over here I need. Give me all your bug meat. Love, love, love! <laughs> they make me so happy. It's the simple things in life, you know? Have made some field snacks. Ooh, maybe I'll get a cave carrot already. That'd be nice. <gasps> a double attack? Oh, oh, oh god. Oh god. That was not good. Holy geodes, Batman. Fuck! Well, I'm gonna eat the... I'll eat these. 
I'm gonna walk away before I pick up anything random. Because... I definitely want that. I don't need slime yet. Shit. <laughs> Shit! I hate not having the big bag. Um... I guess I'll get rid of stone. Although, there's gonna be stone everywhere. I should have gotten rid of the wood. Oh well. Oh well. I can go pick it back up. Probably doesn't make sense to... Do it that way. Okay. And I didn't get the ladder yet. New ideas to sleep on. Maybe a cherry bomb. Ch -ch 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 cherry bomb. Come on! Been playing Stardew since before they started PC Multiplayer Raider. Wow! That's awesome. Oh my god, there's a ladder right here. <laughs> well, you can uh, give me lots of guidance because... Um... I'm still learning, for sure. There's no copper here, for real? Woo! Yeah, take that parry! Take that parry! Die! Hey, his back is against the wall. <laughs> Callback joke. I think, is it Marnie that always wants the cave carrots? Ah, oh, shoot. Dying. I need all of these things. All right, go kill the slime. It's only 5.30, so we've got time to kill the slime. Hopefully we'll get some more copper down below. So satisfying when you get to an elevator level. Let me tell you. No copper. Oof. Pain. Wow. Good luck with the ladder, though. I'll take it. Warning, there are now days where enemies are extra aggressive with extra damage. Ooh. Hello, Grumpy. What is my favorite open world game that I've played so far? Well, my favorite, uh, two of my favorite games are Skyrim or The Witcher 3. So one of those. Oh, torches. No, I like to take these torches, but I have no room. We got so many geodes today. I thought that they were just neutral, but they were giving us good loot. All right, see, have a great night. Thank you for joining us and have, I hope you have a wonderful week. I'm sure we'll see you again. But just in case we don't. Dom Dom, good luck at your job interview tomorrow. Thank you for joining us today. Have a good night. Give it up, slime. Never like backseat. Oh, gamer, I appreciate the heck out of that. I really do. I'm like at the point where I know a decent amount, but um, there'll be things where I, well, I have two days. Will, will Clint be in the, do we try to get to level 10? No, my energy's really freaking low. Probably not, probably cut our losses. Oh, I never did talk to the wizard. Oh, wait. Did I? Did I talk to the wizard? I, never, I don't remember. I did not. Shit. Oh, well. Does this tower lock at 9? Or 7? Does your gaming office get too hot during the summer? 
Uh, yes. Yes, it does. It gets you hot in the winter. Uh, my, my recording space is a bonus room. So, because it's over the garage, it just doesn't quite cool as nicely. And then when we have all the technology running, it just gets wicked hot. Do we think Clint will be in here tonight? Oh, he is. Let's just make sure that this is... Talk to Clint. Okay. Hey! Yay! Oh my god. We can't get our ticket. We can't get our ticket! <laughs> okay. We'll leave the stone there. Gus, don't hate me. I just littered in your fine establishment. I'm gonna be left alone. For now, until you're my best friend! Um, I'm so happy that we named our cat Manon. Pam isn't responding because she'd be drunk. She would be a true lightweight gamer. Well, she would be a heavyweight. But, you know what I mean. Throwing away the cave carrot. The, 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 the cave carrot. I think Barney has a quest coming up, though, for that, though. Wow. My brain's just done for the night. <laughs> it's just looping. <laughs> so fancy. Remix. Okay, so this is my crops. I know that this is a forage, but it's going to stay there. I didn't move these over yet. Bread. Earth crystal. We'll turn that in tomorrow. I don't know if we can make these into anything yet. Topaz. I need one to turn into Gunther. Okay. Um, I don't think I ever watered my beans. I should eat something I foraged. I don't need to... Pass out. Just from watering my beans. Ah! I'm stuck! Best laid plans. <laughs> Top notch swords. <laughs> it's probably good enough to go to bed at this point. That I. I just want to. Okay. Well, I didn't say hi to Manon today. My bad. My bad. Lemons! Cherry bomb! Um, Quave wants to know if we're watching Backlash. Yeah, we're streaming it. We're streaming it, apparently. Yeah, all the premiere live events. He said that. We're gonna try to stream all the premiere live events. We are streaming all the premiere live events. <laughs> End of story. <laughs> non negotiable. This, this one's in France. Bye, Ken. Yeah, so isn't it a weird time for us or no? Yeah, it's like at one or two we talked about this, though. We were just going to need to get... Oh, in the afternoon. Yeah, yeah. Wasn't there one, though, you said it was going to be like five in the morning? I don't want to do that. That's the Saudi events. Okay, we have to... Oh, well, shoot. You know the place that always blows up when we play Pandemic? <laughs> yeah. Riyadh. Stir fry! Neutral. <laughs> he has spoken. Oh. Uh, hi there. Good morning. I've noticed you've been breaking rocks. <laughs> Ooh. 
Ooh, Brady J's in a breakfast stream. I love that. Wow. No kids allowed. No kids allowed. <laughs> Maybe he is wearing a chainmail sweater. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventurer's spirit, that much I can tell. If you can slay ten slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventurer's guild. Oh, I wish it counted what I had already done. I get why it doesn't, but... Okay, I need 20 copper and 25 stones. I don't think I have 20 copper yet. Oh, I do! Make it up some. Oh, wait. Okay, so now since this is a new farm, I don't know how to set it up. So... I guess we're gonna put this here for now. Three or five, you leaving? Have a great night. See you soon. So I guess the stream's gonna go a little past 11, but I'll stop when this day is done because it was an awkward amount of time. But as always, I will not be offended if you guys need to dip out. I appreciate all of you for being here whenever you can be here. So please don't feel guilty if you need to go to bed, because tomorrow's Monday. I might have to watch a follow on after this. Probably shouldn't have done that one. Ah! <laughs> How long are they? Are they an hour? I think so. I mean... So here's the thing. If we don't watch a Fallout, are we going straight to bed? Or are we going to stay up in game a little bit longer? Because if we stay up in game, we're probably going to be up till 12.15 anyways. I mean, yeah, I'm always worried after streams, so. Which sucks, because I actually have to wake up early tomorrow. <laughs> I have to play on the Tuesday stream. Nice. Oh, the beans! To the beans! And we should meet the wizard today. Lots to do today, lots to do today. We're off to see the wizard. You're so mean mentioning Monday. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know this is the Sunday scary go away stream, so I shouldn't be mentioning the evil Mondays. I have to say the best thing about doing this full time now is the elimination of um, Sunday scaries. Right. Happy for you. <laughs> oh, the rare seed is here already. Not that I can afford it. Oh yeah, that Robert Durst thing just got uh, added. We have to finish Fallout before you start that. Am I playing seven games at once? Oh, sure. Am I going to add another? Yep. Ah, come in. This music is just the best. It's my favorite. I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths. Mediary between physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elementals. Keeper of the sacred chest. You get the point. <laughs> and you, Lesla, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. Here, I'd like to show you something. Behold! Cat 
I didn't notice that. It is a cowboy hat. <gasps> it's Arthur. Guys, it's Arthur. He is reincarnated. Reincarnated, yep. <clears throat> That's a new word now. <laughs> Lemons, if I could do that voice, that is 100% his voice. You like to think he's an older version of Gale. Also valid. Ah, new emotes in the chat. Oh, bye. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of this scroll. Uh, Jeron, I'm good. Thanks. <laughs> Wonder if you'll always have a surprise streaming every Sunday. Listen, if I'm feeling up to it, I will stream on Sundays. But I'm not going to write it officially in stone. I'll, I'll bully her if you really want it. <laughs> but this was such a wonderful... Such a wonderful stream. I figured you'd really like this. I just feel so relaxed. Look, at, I'm in my sweatshirt. Reddit has so much pressure. You it gotta be does. Ready. Baby fern, moss, crab, caramel top toadstools. Can you smell it? Maddie, welcome back. Cloudy Wolf, I agree. Here, drink up. Let the essence of the forest permeate your body. Ooh, nice little energy boost there. Guys, I'm invisible. Oh, it's not 420 anymore. That would have been funny. That was an amazing and horrifying blood form video. <laughs> Maddie, horrifying why? I have gained the power of forest magic. Acid drip time. Peyote. <laughs> All right, we need to go to the museum. We need to go to Clint, and we need to go to Lewis's house. I did start turning into a horror sequence. Reminds you of old school JRPGs. Yeah, it definitely has that vibe. I say like I've played them before. <laughs> I say like I know. Should we get... I'm gonna turn this stuff into the museum first. A sardine frenzy? What the fuck? What the sardine? I don't have a fishing pole, I forgot it. I know that I'll probably get something from my geodes to donate to the museum, but I don't really have any inventory space yet, so. Uh, brown and orange are kind of similar, so they'll go together. Ooh, nice. Ah, oh, that one hole will be filled. Oh, is that new? That's new. Ooh. Amazing ending from our pro bud. Hey, thanks.
Madi, I am not gonna lie. I was um really not liking the DLC and it took everything in my power to continue with it, but I'm glad that I did because that second zone of it, I liked a lot better. But that first zone, I was like, fuck this. I do not like this. I don't want to play it. <laughs> it was bad. It was not good. Uh, mm, green. We're definitely going to have to rearrange this, but it's fine. Tegan's op if Tegan opens a streaming next Sunday, her farm will be huge. <laughs> Listen, I won't play this save without you guys. I'm going to hate Elden Ring. Yeah, I'm not going to play it. <laughs> I am not going to play Elden Ring. I refuse. Oh. Hi, Christian. Your day was terrible. Oh, no. Well, kick up your feet and relax a little bit. This is Stardew Valley. Little indie game from Concerned Ape. I say little. It's huge. It's massive. <laughs> Madi, thank you. The um, the emotes are from 8 Bytes. Um, you can follow her on YouTube. She has an amazing YouTube channel. She's also on Twitter and she's on Instagram. Her art channel is a different name, but I forget what it is off the top of my head. But if you follow 8 Bytes, she always shares her stuff from her one account to her other one. So definitely check out her work. She's super talented. Thank you, Haseen. Been playing it and no joke, it took me 13 hours. So, oh my God, no, 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 no. I cannot do that, I refuse. I refuse. So many carrots. I love this ticket system. I know I said that the little pop-up over here was my favorite, but this is, this is my favorite. <laughs> the tickets make me very excited. Jesus, you good dog? All right, I would go fish in that sardine frenzy, but um, don't have my fishing rod, so we're gonna ignore that for now. Oh, frick! I need to give Lewis his gift. Ooh, we're gonna double dip with that. I have to go kill ten slimes anyway, so that's gonna be nice next stream. I'm gonna have to make a list, or I'm gonna forget everything I have to do. Let's go get a parsnip for Lewis. Your birthday's coming up in two weeks? Nice. All right. Um, one parsnip for Lewis. Put that there. We'll plant our seeds in a minute, but I want to catch Lewis while he's there. If you haven't played Demon Souls Remake, I highly recommend, especially after Bloodborne. I have not played any Soulsborne games besides Bloodborne. This is my first one, so... I have not played it. See, this is why. This is why I knew he was going to go away. Say. Ah, uh, you remember the old mayor's birthday. That's very thoughtful of you. Hey, he liked my parsnip. <laughs> sniff, sniff. <laughs> I sense you've been spending time in the old community center. It's good to know someone's taking care of the place. Listen, are you telling me I smell, sir? I probably do. I don't have a bathroom in my house. <gasps> do we pee in a bush like Linus does? I just had that epiphany. Okay, so we have all of those. So we're gonna bring those to the community center. Um, can't do any, oh, we can do the cave carrot too. Fall forging, that's not gonna be, okay. So let's go get stuff to bring to the community center. <laughs> Time to go take a bath with Linus. Oh, I should talk to Harpy while he's right here. Harvey's one of the ones I struggle with the most to get my friendship up with because I just freaking never know his schedule. Ouch. Hi there, miss. Oh my god, I'm sick. Luckily, the community center doesn't close, so I'm not in a rush. Ugh, Harvey. <laughs> Always an honor when the mayor sniffs you. It's a sign of real friendship. It's Cause he, I gave him my parsnip. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, they blended in. I almost didn't see them. <gasps> a vertebra. Yeah. 
Uh, wait. Oh, okay. Guess I don't get anything from that one. That's okay. Um, so we needed one of these, one of these, one of these, one of these. I don't have enough room for that. I guess I can put that back for now. One of these, and then none of this is unlocked yet. Oh, yeah, I'm not doing the wood yet, though. Not gonna do the wood yet. All right, let's at least get these planted. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to water them today. I probably should be able to. I got a lot, though. Damn. Should I start going this way? Oh god, this is gonna be so bad when things start sprouting. <laughs> the hell was walking around? Did you hear that? Was that my cat? Manon! What are you doing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten! <laughs> the awkward amount! I'm saving those. I'm saving them. I'm not making any more. Oh, shit. I'm the worst at remembering the fertilizer. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. Okay. That's fine. Like in real life, I often get so busy doing my thing, I forget to talk to people. Same. Same. Lemons has been my friend long enough that she knows I am the worst. <laughs> I am the worst at responding to people. It doesn't mean I don't love you. It's just who I am. Hello, Ragman. How are you? Do I ever take a day off? No, I don't, actually. Thank you for asking. Joseph agreed. Yeah, if we have any um, new viewers in chat, feel free to subscribe. We stream a lot. Um, and if streams... Well, you're watching a stream, so streams are probably your thing. But, you know, if you don't necessarily always want to stream, I post pre-recorded videos. Holy spring seeds. A lot as well. Exotic foraging. This is every day this week. Yeah, I, I posted something every day this week. Mel, I haven't heard a lot about it, but um, it's the Haunted Chocolatier one, right? Good news is I got my... You got your what? My work bag packed. Nice. Bundle complete on day seven. I'm gonna chill in the living room. Waiting for it to be done. Sounds good. As soon as this day is done, I will be done. Okay, so we need one of each. These are not done growing yet. I can do a parsnip though. And I need five quality parsnips. Fingers crossed. Not even close to any of those yet, but that's okay. Four of those. All right. So we're making good progress. What brought me to your channel was the control playthrough. Love. Heck yeah! I hope you enjoyed. That was so unlike anything I had played before. So um, I was definitely overwhelmed, but I loved that game. Okay. We have, we definitely have an oyster and I think we have a mussel. Uh, obviously we don't have specialty fish yet. We need another large mouth. We definitely have... Oh, we don't have a carp yet. Um, I haven't really done any ocean fishing. So we still need a lot for that, but that's okay. Oh, shoot. I don't think I'm going to make it to the museum. That closes at 7, doesn't it? Mm, it's going to be close. It's going to be close. Oh shit. I'm gonna get to the doors and it's gonna be seven and I'm gonna be so sad. <laughs> Run! Oh, I'm not making it. I'm not making it! 
Oh, it closed at six anyways. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought it closed at seven. <laughs> I would have made it. I would have made it. I love how it seems like all of the Remedy games kind of like connect to each other or have Easter eggs or whatever. That's always nice. I still forgot to pick up my freaking fishing pole. Damn it. Hey, my stone. <laughs> Thanks for holding on to that for me, Gus. Barney, I wasn't very productive today either. That's okay. We can't always be productive. Better leave her alone. Hi, Lazla. I'll need a loom. You're on the edge of your seat. Everyone was so concerned about me making it, and then it closed an hour before. <laughs> Did I water my beans? Did I pet Manon? I don't think I petted Manon. I think I watered my beans. I don't think I watered my beans. Shit. I don't remember. All the days are blurring together. Joseph, that music is amazing. Amazing. Um, okay, we need that. Disney cowboy music is a great way to describe it, though. I don't know if I water these. I can't tell. I'm going to water them again, though. Just to be safe. Watering my plants, watering my plants, watering my plants is a wonderful thing to do. Done. Okay. Uh, I don't think I can freaking plant the horse radish seeds or the spring seeds because there's just no way. There's just no way I'm going to be able to water all that. Um, okay. I don't really have... I guess I could make... Hmm. No, I'll save that. Let's see what I can make right now. Do, 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 do. Nothing. I don't think there's really anything I need yet. I have some energy left. I can chop some more trees. Oh, wait. Hello. Hello! Bye, Gwee. Have a great night. See you later this week. Chop, chop, chop. We're almost out of energy. I don't think I'm going to have enough for this. We'll get the rest tomorrow. Uh... Okay. Might as well just fill this up, though. Oh, God. That counts as energy. Don't do that. Don't do that. Yeah, gamer, I haven't used... Oh, I just scythed my cat. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, I haven't used text signs yet, but um, I can definitely see how they'd be useful. Let's see. We'll just keep that going right now. And I'm going to be a little bit, I'm blue, da ba dee da ba die. All right, folks. Just a quick haircut. That's all. That's all. Um, thank you so much for joining me tonight. I know that this is totally different than anything I've ever done before, but it was really relaxing and I had a great time and I hope you did too. I like that we just got to hang out and chat for a long time. 
And hopefully, if you are a sufferer of the Sunday Scaries, I hope this helped a little bit. No! Stream forever! Thank you for joining, Stream Adi. Thanks, Reese. Ah! New emotes! That made me so happy! <laughs> They're so cute! Um, good night, Maxwell. Thank you for joining. So yeah, like I said, we will be back to Red Dead on Mondays and Wednesdays. Um, Friday will still be Freaky Friday. Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday will be on Twitch if you're interested. And pre-recorded videos will still be on Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday. Right? Yeah. <laughs> if you haven't watched it yet, I've reacted to Shawshank, Re Shawshank Redemption over on my reaction channel. Uh, people seem to be really liking it. So if you haven't watched it yet, go check that out too. And Nightlight, appreciate the heck out of you all. This was great. Uh, and I hope to continue to do this on Sundays. I also want to try to bring back member streams, but don't ask me when the heck I'm going to do that because literally every night is something. <laughs> every night is something. Um, but I hope you guys like the new emotes. And I think that's everything. But I hope you have a great week. Maybe see you tomorrow. And sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs, bed bugs bite. And... I think that's everything. Bye-bye! <laughs>